Lefe, and today I'm going to teach you how to sight read. This is Sight Reading 101. So, we have, we have treble clef and bass clef. Now, cello plays bass clef, so it's my favorite. But treble clef is pretty cool as well. So we're going to start with a C major scale in both. C, D, E, F, G, A, D, or H, C. Then we have sharps and flats that alter the note up a half step in either a sharp or flat direction. So this is a sharp, this is a flat. B in treble clef. When you put a sharp in front of it, it becomes B sharp. This is a bad example because B sharp is C natural. So I'm going to use another example. If you put a sharp in front of C, it becomes C sharp, so that C becomes a C sharp. And when you put a flat in front of the C, it becomes a C flat. A C flat is also a B, so this is also a weird example. G in bass clef is here. This is a G. This is a G in bass clef. If you put a sharp in front of the G, it becomes a G sharp. If you put a flat in front of the G, it becomes a G flat. This is a sharp and this is a flat, just to review. And what do we have here? C major scale. All right, my chickens, moving on. Today we are going to be review Today we are going to be reviewing four types of notes. So we have the whole note. We have the half note. We have a quarter note. And an eighth note. All of these different notes last for different lengths of time. This one will last a full measure. It's actually so confusing. <laughs> yeah, do we need to go over what a measure is? <laughs> I didn't talk about measures. Okay, actually, maybe maybe just Google that one. Anyways, okay, guys, that was my sight reading 101. All the sheet music to Bewitched is available now. Good luck. Good luck, lovers. Bewitched is out September 8th.